a guest tonight. It's nice to meet you. Let me tell uh, the people a little about you. My guest today is Dr. Ellen. Dr. Ellen is a psychologist, registered dietitian, national board certificate health and wellness coach, and Reiki master. I, I like that. Uh, and mind self compassion teacher known as the midlife whisperer, TM. Oh, I don't read that. Uh, she helps women raise vibration so they have the energy confidence and clarity to make the next chapter of their best chapter a best-selling award-winning author inspire inspirational speaker and expert woman on well-being dr ellen has appeared on extra the food network and nbc world news and has been quoted in psychology today eating well and usa today right and and uh she has written five books and articles for self better home and gardening and good horse keep housekeeping uh, her in late her her, her her latest book is rock your midlife uh, seven steps to transformation yourself and make a new chapter uh, your best chapter. That's pretty impressive. Uh, Thank you. Uh, she brings over 25 years of counseling, coaching, and healing experience to her holistic practice and transformational work. She lives on the Champlain Islands of Vermont uh, uh, with her high-tech, raw food-loving partner, Ken and her tree climbing border collie, Rosie. This, this is pretty cool. Dr. Ellen has spoken at a University of Vermont, the American Heart Association, the E-Woman Network, Well Coaches Inc, Rally, Real, uh, Real, uh, Real Yard, Apocalypse, Yoga Roots, Champion College, Boston Spot Sports Club, Fit Corp, the up uh, of the Food Network Extra, and Good Day New York. I mean, th this is amazing. Well, welcome to the show. Uh, oh God, where's your name now? I oh, Dr. Ellen. Ellen. Uh, just, just call me Dr. Ellen, Robert. Oh, That's okay. fine. Nice I'm to sorry. be here. I'm, it's okay. I'm just, I'm just a little nervous. First, uh, first show I've done. So. Oh my goodness! This yeah. is your first show. Yeah, I'm a, my stomach's a little. I've been running in and out of the bathroom the oh whole. Oh my gosh! I, I, well, I, I, should, I should send you some Reiki. Some Reiki? I don't. Well, what for leaves? What is that? Can you explain <laughs> to these people. No, Reiki it, is a kind of healing. You read it in my bio. It's a type oh, of okay. healing energy to help you. But you might want to just take a couple breaths. Okay. Okay. This is a little too much for me. I mean, I don't, uh, yeah, but, uh, yeah, Reiki. Yeah. If I can learn how to Reiki, I would love it because I, I, I get stressed out very simple. That's why I don't go out much and nothing. And, uh, that we're going to like read, I have to read all the super chats that come up. Uh, Dave, Dave Daffler, uh, five dollars. Congratulations, Bob on, uh, new show. Just remember that even the Titanic had to, Titanic had survivors. Okay, okay. I I I am trying. Okay. I want to get on one of the boats. Uh but yeah, uh okay, here's another I have to read these. Uh Pretty Bird two dollar. Hey Robert, do you remember me? I I I can't tell by the bird picture. Uh so uh how many you've been writing books in that, huh? It must be is it hard to uh write things down? Um <laughs> It's it is a challenge being a writer, yeah, but um it's very rewarding. So it's yeah. uh there but it's uh, it is a lot of work to write, but I enjoy doing it and I enjoy the results when people read my books and they uh, get a good information that really helps them. Okay. So it's it's quite re rewarding, but it's not the easiest profession. Yeah, no, books. I I don't I don't I don't read really because it just it doesn't work. Nick one ninety nine. What word salad this is? Uh, I I wish I could answer him. King of uh, all dabblers. Two dollars. Robert, are are you? Am, am I muted? Can you not hear me? No, you're not muted. You sound great. 
I, I do. Okay, so why would why would somebody put money in to send that to me to try to throw me off? Uh, uh, which book did you write uh, third? You wrote five. Which one did you write th third? Oh, um, I wrote, uh, let's see, Temptations, Igniting the, um, mm -hmm. I don't remember that one that much. I was with my ex-husband. So my ex-husband and I were the cooking couple in the 90s. So we wrote three books together. So it was and, called Temptations, Igniting the Pleasure and Power of Aphrodisiacs. And that was and it. He, and, and he, he cooked and, uh, okay. Here's another one. Franklin Sheckler, great show. Me, and Moop. What ag ad adhesive uh, for fang dingy dangerous clingy? Thank you for your time. Ding I don't even know what he's talking about. I, I mean, I have one more. Hey, uh, HPE 499, Robert, what is your uh, opinion? And it's the best way to get out of jury du jury duty to get out of it. I just tell them I'm not white. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. They never called me yet. Like, have you been to jury duty? Have you ever? Have I? I? Yeah, I have been in jury duty. It was interesting. I was on a case. Uh, well, what, I don't know what, why people make such a big deal about being on jury duty. It's like, like going root canal or something. It's really interest. It's an interesting process and it's part of our democracy. So it's really not this horrible thing. I mean, I guess if you're on a case for a long time and you know, yeah. you need to, you need to make money and things I could see, or you've got childcare and things like that. Um, I can understand, uh -huh. but if you can swing it, it can be actually very interesting. It was an interesting case where, um, what if you have pets? How do you do it? Like how, who feeds them? Like if you, well, you're, you're, not, you're not, you know, you're, you're, it's, uh, they've got you. I don't know. I was only there for like a day and a half. So um, one day was picking the jury and the next day was the case. And uh, it was an interesting uh, case. So my, my pets were fine. Okay. Yeah. Cause I don't, I look, I, I don't know uh, about, you know, cause I don't have a pet, but if I did, it would be a problem to go to the jury duty and then to stay like if it was a big case, I, I don't know. Uh, it would scare me. I like just being out there with like people telling me I had to listen to something and tell what I think about it would be like, I would. Okay. Austin, $2. I love Vermont. Vermont. Robert. Vermont. But what? Vermont, Vermont, where I'm from. Oh, is uh, what part of Maine is that? It's not part of Maine. Vermont's is another state. Oh man, this is thrown. I'm sorry. Uh, pretty bird. Vermont's a state. It borders on New York and New Hampshire and Can uh -huh. Canada. Okay. I live okay. about 90 minutes from Montreal, and I live uh, on an island in Lake Champlain. Really? So it doesn't say on here that you're Canadian, but I'm not okay. Canadian. I'm American. Oh. Oh, okay. But I live close to Canada. Okay, okay. Pretty bird, two dollars. Tell Dr. Ellen what you did. To, let's go to somebody else real quick. Uh, don't don't even pay attention to that one. Uh, corn pop, one ninety nine. A lot of birds in here. I'm scared. Uh, it, it. Terry Nee, uh, two dollars. You don't read too good. Uh, no, I don't read well. Is that how? Like, is that what you like? What do you like when you? Uh, when somebody says like when you read and somebody does not un like if you're reading and they don't understand is that like what is the best way you pronounce it i don't read very well not good right right so um i don't have all that much time because initially our, our okay. interview was scheduled for six. Oh yeah yeah sorry i had these, uh, these stomach problems i just um my wife was mad at me because uh, the, i broke the plunge I, uh, wait hold on one more i'll get to this uh, franklin sheckler stay calm chingy sound out me 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 the word moop dingy dingy bat and pull buddy my, my, i'm trying to i'm trying to my wife is very mad, like she gets mad at me for no reason because I, I was cooking earlier and she's mad at me because I I left the stuff on the, uh, this, I didn't put it out of the pan when I cooked it. I just left it uh, on the pan, in the, on the stove and she's like really mad. Uh, show sound per, what? Uh, St. Ranger 195, uh, to, what? Did you break the, the garbage disposal? 
I didn't break the garbage disposal. Okay. It was well, broken I before. Have to go no way. Myself. Hold on. You shut the fuck up. I swear to okay. God, you fucking come in this fucking room again. I smack the shit out of you right now. That didn't last long. <laughs> 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 I mean, a fucking masterpiece. A masterpiece. <laughs> or no zone. <laughs> now, now, now we have now we have a time to put up and see who can who can beat it. You know. How long was that? Oh, 10 minutes. Nervous ten Bob minutes. is frightening. Even Bob's internet is scared. My internet was going out too. Show me the bird <laughs> where Bob touched you. Stop it, you fire. <laughs> I love oh, this my... question somebody put up. You didn't get to it. Oh, it man, she up. bailed fucking quick. Doctor, I hope you find your work fascinating. What do you think of Robin's cave? I'll hang up and listen. Off air. That didn't what the last. fuck happened? I, I just got back and she's gone. But what, what you, she's crazy. I, I mean, I had to do the show. I'm trying to do my own show and she, she just does this. And, <laughs> and, you know, and she got mad about me cooking. <laughs> Uh, Dave Davila, two dollars. Isn't Bob in December of his year? Well, in December of my years, what do you HPA for? Hey, Robert, love this show. Tim Travel, Pooh, or Khan? I don't know what Tim Travel is. Uh, Franklin Sheckler, two dollars. Moop, uh, Franklin, applause for Jan. Sorry, she sorry. was very good, she knew what to do. Uh, yeah. show me on the bird with Bob. I know where and I didn't touch you. Nervous Bob is frightening. Questions were all birds, right? Out even game. even Bob's in an escape. <laughs> I don't know it was going out. The doc, um, doctor. Uh, uh, yeah, we uh, did that one. Oh uh, yeah, uh, I can't be reading the same one. My connection cut out with a can Canadian champagne. Uh, <laughs> Rollade spells relief. I didn't even get to talk about Del. Does Ellen fucking have a pull? <laughs> Would you stop? Why? Why, why you got to do this to me? Uh, Dale W. Oh. Order zone and steals <laughs> batteries. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even get to ask her about her fucking Reiki shit. You know what that is, actually? Uh, would Reiki, you, Bob? Yeah. Costa? Reiki is when you give somebody like a massage, but you don't touch them. You're around energy. their body. It, yeah, it's energy. It's full of shit. She's out of yeah. her mind. That's why she ran out of here like that. She was scared to talk to a man that fucking goes against uh, everything that's good in the world. You know? Bob, Bob, you were great. Was you, were I? So, you were so fucking good. Really? You really were. I mean, a whole new side. Who knew yeah. you had this much range? The nervous yeah. Yeah. first time Amazing. Bob Levy. Amazing. Uh, I mean, she if you were if you didn't do that, she would have been gone in two minutes. Yeah. Yeah. I know, I know. She, That's wouldn't, what, have made, uh, she wouldn't have my, lasted through that intro. <laughs> my big daddy Dodo. No, this is no my in at 199, my new favorite show. Thank you. No. By the way, Dodo, you <laughs> walked in with the cape. What? Dodo, you walked in with the cape and Big Daddy Dodo wrote, it's already a hit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody oh, else Rob Soul. Somebody, <laughs> Somebody wrote sign him to a five-year contract. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. That was like when she started yelling at me, that was like yeah. I knew she was trying to get away. And I was like, yeah. my, my my wife's yeah. not mad at me. Yeah. I knew it was coming soon, but I thought I could have lasted. Yeah. I thought was I was it? gonna make it uh Saint Ranger three dollars. Holy switch cheese. She lasted 12 minutes, I she believe. Never asked why. No, and that's one of the reasons why we decided. Uh, that he should come in with a cape. And, just... and you know what the sad thing is? I've had this on the bed over here for about two months now, and we could not get a guest. They kept, kept backing out and all that. Yeah, yeah. She and wanted was... out so fast. Oh, that was great. Oh, yeah. yeah she, started, she started like, well, I only have limited time. Yeah, what happened yeah. with her eyes? Like when I didn't look at her when I was reading and I was right. fucking up everything like really bad. Like was she like, and what was her reaction? She to was me? trying to be cool she about it. Be nice. could... Yeah. yeah. Okay. And she was just kind of politely listening yeah. and smiling, uh, but and a couple I of mean, the things, the, the way you pronounce stuff, she would go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what do you think? Goes, I love Vermont. <laughs> Vermont. <laughs> Vermont. <laughs> oh my God! Uh, I'm calling the Guinness Book of Records, Dave Daffel, at two dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see these quotes later on, on what I said. I don't even know what I said. Uh, I was a little nervous because you know I never. I was yeah. nervous, and I'm I'm not even doing it. Yeah. I'm just not there. 
uh, Terry Nee faking the reading was great. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I do that on a few shows now. Yeah. Uh, Dave Neville at $2. The Bob's next guest, Oasis Reunion. I definitely will. I have to get them back together. <laughs> Gray Fox, 499. <laughs> Riley, can you hear me? Can we play this again? Look at the look on her face. Uh, <laughs> Can we no, play it from the beginning and just see because and then we can do a little back and forth no, on it because just... I, I I didn't know what was going like I was trying to really get into this fucking stupid character uh, yeah it was my amazing. name is Robert. It was amazing Devin wow. says I think this could work but it needs to be polished up a bit maybe some normal qu no the whole point is yeah. there's no questions for the guest at all at all yeah <laughs> how long will they sit there for a plug. Yeah, and that was like she just wanted out there. Uh, yeah, play it back and let's play a little. Let's I never said little... this would be an hour long show. I just told you it's a new show coming right. to the network. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there'll be people that will stay on. There's no doubt. Now, this is it here. Yeah. Okay. People well, probably. This, this entrance is the best. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we don't hear it. Uh. <clears throat> <laughs> hey guest night it's nice to meet you let me tell uh the people a little about you My guest is dr ellen dr ellen is a psychologist registered dietitian a national board certificate health and wellness coach and reiki master i, I like that uh and mind self compassion teacher known as the midlife whisperer hold on pause yes. this oh i don't read that let me tell you how amazing this show is this guy has never complimented us and never donated a penny blinky jedi oh my god that was awesome keeper uh -oh. Thank you, sir. I told wow. him we would get him. I told him we're going to end up being best friends, mm -hmm. even though he wow. didn't like us at the beginning. I like when girls play rough. Okay. Wow. Like <laughs> oh, my God. If Bob could read, that show would have lasted. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Frankie B. Uh, no, no, I mean, I, 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 it's nervous to be able to read all this. And Mike had two things, and I didn't even read it all. I figured if I read it all, she would have hung up. Good yeah. job, Gina. Yeah, thank you. Happy yeah. days. Uh, yeah. So play yeah. this again because she's starting to. Her face is like, I don't know what I got into. I can't believe I'm here. Hey, you do that. I gotta t check on the kids. Uh, no volume. Uh, whisper. I like that. Uh, and mind, self, compassion teacher, known as the midlife whisperer, TM. Oh, I don't read that. Uh, she helps <laughs> women raise vibrations so they have the energy, confidence, and clarity to make the next chapter of their best. Yeah, now she's trying. She's trying to be real cool now. She's yeah. like, all right, we'll give him a chance. Author, yeah. inspi inspirational speaker and expert woman on well-being, Dr. Ellen has it. <laughs> on Extra, <laughs> the Food Network, and NBC World News, and has been. Quoted in like, psychology <laughs> <Why? laughs> well, and a today, right? And and uh, she has written five books and articles for self better home and gardening and good horse keep housekeeping. Uh, <laughs> her, 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 <laughs> and there's oh, that first look like her latest yeah, book yeah. is Rock Your Midlife the Seven Steps to Transformation Yourself and Make a New Chapter. Uh, your best chapter. That's pretty impressive. Uh, Thank you. Uh, she brings over 25 <laughs> years of counseling, <laughs> coaching, and healing experience to her holistic practice and transformation you, work. She lives on the Champlain Islands of Vermont uh, uh, with her high tech, raw food loving partner, Ken and her tree climbing border collie, Rosie. This, this is pretty cool. Dr. <laughs> <laughs> Vermont, the American oh. Hockey Association, the E-Woman oh. Network, Well Coaches, Inc., oh. Rally, Rally, uh, 
rail yard, hypocrisy, <laughs> yoga roots, roots, champion college, Boston spot sports club, fit co-op the up uh, of the food network extra and good day, New York. I mean, th this is amazing. Well, welcome to the show. Uh, Oh God, where's your name now? I do Dr. Ellen. Ellen. <laughs> oh. Dr. Ellen Robert. Oh, That's okay. fine. Nice I'm to sorry. be here. I'm, it's okay. I'm just, I'm just a little nervous. First, uh, first show I've done. So. Oh my goodness! This yeah. is your first show. Yeah, I'm a, my stomach's a little. I've been running in and out of the bathroom. The oh whole, my gosh! I, well, I, I, should, I should send you some Reiki. Some Reiki? I don't. Oh, what for leaves? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> To these people no reiki is the kind of healing you read it in my bio it's a type oh, of okay. healing energy to help you but you might want to just take a couple breaths okay okay this is a little too much for me i mean <laughs> you're right, uh, right. Yeah, but, uh yeah reiki yeah if i can learn how to reiki i would love it because i i i get stressed out very simple that's why i don't go out much or nothing and uh that we're going to like read i have to read all the super chats to come up uh dave, dave daffola uh five dollars congratulations bob on a uh, new show just remember oh. that even the titanic had to titanic oh okay, okay. I, I i am trying okay i want to get on one of the boats uh but yeah okay here's another well, i have to read these uh pretty bird two dollars hey robert do you remember me i i I can't tell by the bird picture. Uh, so, uh, how many you've been writing books in that, huh? It must be, <laughs> think down. Um, it's it is a challenge being a writer, yeah, but um, it's very rewarding. So it's um, <laughs> it's it is a lot of work to write, but I enjoy doing it, and I enjoy the results when people read my books and they uh, mm. get a good information that really helps them. <laughs> So it's it's quite re rewarding, but it's not the easiest. <laughs> yeah, no books. I I don't I don't I, I don't read really because it just it doesn't work. Nick one ninety nine. <laughs> what word salad this is? Uh, I, I wish I could answer him. King of uh, all dabblers, two dollars. Robert, are are you? Am, am I muted? Can you not hear me? No, you're not muted. You sound great. <laughs> you? Okay. So why would why would somebody put money in to send that to me to try to throw me off? Uh, and now uh, he's got, right, now got, got her involved her, with the her psychology her. of the thing. Right. Yeah. Oh God, sorry. Her. Oh, um, I wrote, uh, let's see, Temptations, Igniting the... Look at my uh, hand shaking. Look. I were the cooking couple in the 90s, so we wrote three books together. So it was okay. called Temptations, Igniting the Pleasure and Power of Aphrodisiacs. And that was and it. He, and he, and he booked and... Uh, okay. Here's uh, uh, Franklin Sheckler. Uh, <laughs> your internet going out. <laughs> yeah, that's... Moop. What ag adhesive uh, for fangs? <laughs> Look at her face. Look at her. Thank you for your time, Ding. I don't even know what he's talking about. <laughs> I, have, <laughs> I have one more. Hey, uh, HPE 499, Rob, what is your uh, opinion in <laughs> the best <laughs> uh, of jury, du jury duty to get out of it? I just tell him I'm not white. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. You never called me yet. Like, yeah, you've been the jury. Take a big gulp of water there. Jeez. Uh, have I? I? Yeah, I have been in jury duty. It was interesting. I was on a case. Uh, well, what, I don't know what, why what? people make such a big deal about being on jury duty. It's like, like going root canal or something. It would have been great if you would have been like. It's an interesting process and it's part of our democracy. Guilty. Did you give him the electric chair? Is he dead now because of you? Oh, man. It's really not this horrible thing. I mean, I guess if you're on a case for a long time and you know yeah. you need to you need to make money and things I could see, or you've got childcare and things like that, um, I can understand. Uh, but if you can swim, look at my camera. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, what if you have pets? How do you do it? Like, how <laughs> who feeds them? Like, if you well, you're, you're, not, you're not, you know, you're you're it's, wow. they've got you. I don't know. I was only there for like a day and a half, so um, one day was picking the jury, and the next day was the case, and uh, it was an interesting uh, case. So, my, my pets were fine, okay? Yeah, because I don't, I look, I, I don't know, uh, 
about you know because i don't have a pet but if i did it would be a problem to go to the jury duty and then to stay like if it was a big case i i don't know uh, it would scare me <laughs> I like just being out there with like people telling me i had to listen to something and tell what i think about it would be like i would okay austin two dollars i love vermin vermont Robin. vermont, <laughs> vermont oh. where i'm from Oh, is uh, what part of Maine is that? That's <laughs> another state. Oh man, this is drone. I'm sorry. Uh, pretty bird. Vermont state borders on New York and New Hampshire and uh -huh. Canada. Okay. Mean, like, uh, I live about okay. 90 minutes from Montreal, and I live uh, on an island in Lake Champlain. Really? So it doesn't say on here that you're Canadian, but I'm not okay. Canadian. I'm American. <laughs> Okay. But I live close to Canada. Okay. Okay. Pretty bird. Two dollars. Oh. Tell Dr. Allen what you did. To Let's go to somebody else real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a lot of birds in here. I'm scared. <sighs> Terry Nee, uh, two dollars. You don't read too good. Uh, no, I don't read well. Is that how? You like is that what you like what do you like when you uh when somebody says like can you read and <laughs> like if you're reading and they don't understand is that like what is the best way do you pronounce it i don't read very well not <laughs> what this is, but I'm <laughs> right. so, um, i don't have all that much time because initially now, was that, was, it was, it was, it's not for is that dog now live with you, Bob, or is that on the... Uh... No, no, he's live now. Oh, okay, I was going to say... Get uh, the fuck have, up! You didn't have a pet, I forgot. Jesus Christ, I'm doing a show after a show! It's okay, but I, you, didn't, you said you didn't have a pet, and it would have been funny if it was a dog. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm like, he's a genius. Oh, wait, the dog's in here. That's why he's trying to get out. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I give Shuli, please try to read I don't, I don't think she's good. I think we can figure out that whole Middle East uh, saga before yeah. we get her back on the show. Oh, Dr. Ellen. Maybe Ooh. starting with a doctor wasn't a good decision. No. <laughs> well, I mean, we started with whoever said they yeah. do it, really. We, she wasn't our first choice. <laughs> uh, for Bob's cancer charity. That's great. Yeah. I Kali. <laughs> yeah, she she did faster, no chapo. <laughs> oh my god! I look good, I'll tell you. Well, yeah, when that camera kicks in, it's beautiful. Go ahead. Six? Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, I had these uh, the stomach problems. I just um, my wife was mad at me because uh, that I broke the plunge. I, uh, wait, hold on, one more. I'll get to this. Uh, Franklin, check. <laughs> Stay. Calm, chingy, sound out, meet, 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 meet the word, moop, dingy, dingy, bat and pull, buddy. Mop, mop. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. My wife is <laughs> Look at her face. like she gets mad at me for no reason because I, I was cooking earlier and she's mad at me because I I left the stuff on the uh this. I didn't put it out of the pan when I cooked it. I just left it uh, on the pan. In the, on the stove, and she's like really mad. Uh, show sound per what? Uh, Saint Ranger <laughs> one nine five. Not, uh, to, what? Did you break the, the garbage disposal? I didn't break the garbage disposal. Okay. It was well, broken I before. Have to go no way. Myself. Oh, you shut the fuck up! I shut <laughs> up in the second room again. I smacked the shit out of you. Right <laughs> <now>. <laughs> 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 Oh, oh, God. God. oh Again, bro. another round of applause oh, for Bob Levy. For Robert uh, Levy. Robert. I mean, unbelievable. Wow. Unbelievable. Fantastic. It could couldn't have gone any better. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hit. It's, this is what I love about this new chapter in my life is mm -hmm. that I'm I'm working with my friends. Yeah. I I am loving I thought you I'm, were working with us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving what I do. And most importantly, whatever dumb shit we think of, we can try it. We can do it. We don't have to. Thanks to you guys supporting yeah. us, man. I, I mean, it's unbelievable. And and uh, yeah, that was fucking awesome. That was great. And we will have sounds coming up soon. I'll say that they're doing construction of my house. They're doing this. Oh, whatever. yeah. We, yeah. Start putting yeah. Sound effect. we got a lot of shit. We'll talk. You gave me a lot of ideas today. 
Thank you, River. Thank you, Look River. at this. Uh, the show is worth more donation. I haven't laughed so hard oh, all God. week. Well, God. Oh, well, yeah. yeah. I mean, I this was. Some people were saying it's, just, it's like we're trying to get a uh, donation. No. Of it. no, it's just. It's like, look, uh, if we just say we'll read every chat, then people are just going to write cunt. And, you know, a lot yeah. of times people that want to write that don't have a dollar ninety nine to spend on a super <laughs> chat. So, you know, yeah. and the, my my whole thing was like, I love the questions that had nothing to do with the guest and mm. nothing to do with you. Mm. Yeah. Like the, jury, like the jury duty question was great. great. Yeah. yeah. Uh, stuff like that is great. And it's just a staircase. We just, the longer they go, the weirder the fucking questions got to get. Yeah. And, and then it, the it weird thing, like I, I have ideas for just flashing up, like people just popping up in the stream during the interview, and you just like be like sometimes like a crossover from other shows. Like like remember when people's phone signals used to bleed in? Yeah, I'll be things? like my in and out. I got Comcast, it's horrible, you know. <laughs> no, but I, it's yeah, what am I doing? I don't know. I, yeah. I, Oh. Listen, between uh, this morning BS with Bob with his uh, with his gagging, I laughed till I almost th threw up. Mm -hmm. And tonight, you doing this, Bob? I laughed till I almost threw up. Luckily, we have Chad on Miserable Men, so I don't have to worry about laughing. There you go. Yeah, now, now you. This show has potential. I think the three of you watching it back is a must. Well, let me tell you something. If they all last nine minutes, that's exactly what's going to happen. <laughs> yeah, but it's fun. I mean, look, we're having fun. Like, like, look, if you don't have, you want to join the Patreon, it's only five to ten dollars a month. If you, you know what I mean, or whatever. But you people give more in the chats, and yeah. you know what I mean. Sign up. I mean, yeah. you get everything. Right. Sam Adams, two dollars. And you know what? Maybe we'll what do. do maybe this guy had a good suggestion. Hold on. Uh, oh, I was hoping for hair advice with Sam Adams thing, but this guy had uh, a good yeah. suggestion. Where was it? Uh, about pre doing like a uh, pre questions. Maybe we should do that on uh, Patreon, where we'll put up a post for people's hmm. questions ahead of time. Maybe I don't yeah. know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Terry Nay, two dollars. You will. Need a ramp rumble off ramp. What 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 is how was this how was rumble today? By the way, oh, it was it went smooth. We had uh, uh, Owen Benjamin on. He was really good, very entertaining yeah. fella. I liked him a lot. Uh, yeah, we're doing another show at uh, eight o'clock tonight, and then this will come back when whenever we can get guests. You know, so yeah. Yeah, well, if you if you know somebody that you think might be a good fit for the show, obviously not, you know, people don't tell not them. from this world and not mm -hmm. not uh, on on the up and up, and uh, yeah, and don't tell them and he hit us up. Uh, or even if you see someone who's on another podcast yeah. or something, so right? Look, that's even right. better. Yeah, truly, like you did with Underdog audience questions. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do a Patreon only <laughs> show oh, where we can, where we can do. One of the, that's mm. still the most productive meeting, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I think she learned a lot. <laughs> She's a so, psychologist. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> from Vermont, from Vermont, Canada. Yeah. Uh, yeah, all no, right. Well, we'll fun. see you guys at eight o'clock here. Miserable men with Chad Zumach. Thank you guys. Uh, yeah, you guys rule. This. Truthfully, yeah. you guys Thanks, make guys. our Thanks, days guys. like like we make your days. We yeah, make our man. Day. This, this maiden voyage could not have happened without you guys. So thank you very much. Appreciate it. We'll see you at eight. Uh, YouTube, Patreon. Uh, we're going full blast tonight. The mm -hmm. Z Man joining us. All right. Boom. We'll Let's see you it. later. See you later. <laughs>